highlights channel of the Ranveer Show. This is TRS Clips. Fortunately, I've not had a cigarettes phase in right. life. I don't know, just by chance. Uh, do you know what vaping is? Yes. Okay. Do I've you know that? <laughs> do you know that everyone's into vaping now? Okay, by, uh, let me clarify. I don't know whether it's like uh, the, the definition has changed, but vape is, e-cigarette is vaping. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, but uh, the modern day e-cigarettes are much better looking, okay. much better tasting. Right. And uh, it gives you maybe a sharper high. Uh, there are certain brands which and you get those very easily. You get these like 2000 rupee cartridges which will last you over a long time. So okay, the jewels. Or yeah, yeah, jewels. Like, yeah, yeah, I've uh, tried that. I actually tried it when I was smoking the e-cigarette, but it was horrible because I could not regulate the amount of nicotine that was going in. So it was kind of... What know, does that mean? So, you know, your body gets used to the nicotine that is there in every, you know, a cigarette. And it's like you, you can, I'm comfortable. I used to be comfortable smoking one cigarette, but I was never a chain smoker. So I would get uh, horrible, feel nausea if I smoke three cigarettes in one go. Mm. You know, you like you taking in more nicotine than is required. So e-cigarette, I could not regulate that. So I stopped that. I went back to smoking. <laughs> because you keep pulling like yeah. e-cigarettes and yes. you don't know where to stop. Yeah. yeah. Basically. Yeah. Correct. Okay. Correct. Personally, I would say logically, e-cigarettes would be safer than cigarettes because you're not burning anything. Mm. The carcinogens that are coming um, are coming from the cigarette smoke uh, and the ash and the burning of it. Nicotine is not a carcinogen. Mm. Of course, nicotine is the most addictive substance on earth. So, uh, you know, even e-cigarettes are dangerous in that sense. Um, also, it's not clear what else is in that e-cigarette. Right. Especially the ones that come out of China. Okay. No one knows specifically okay. what's gone into making mm. it. So I think yeah, that's No one knows fear. anything that comes out of China, what it is. <laughs> <laughs> Except COVID. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah. I think the world has... I see fewer people smoking, smoking. Uh, cigarettes generally for mm. sure. 10 years back when I was in engineering college, everyone was into it. Yes. Uh, I think people have moved on to marijuana. <laughs> 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 That's the truth. Uh, is is uh, is that a live confession you're making? On I have spoken <laughs> about it. Like this is back in college. You know, it's very embarrassing for me because I did not, I smoked marijuana to get high to see the experience, but I didn't get high. Then a couple of my friends were smoking it through that damn secondhand smoke I got. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> it was damn, they laugh at me. They say, Ye hasna shuru ho gaya isne auro ke smoke se. <laughs> <laughs> it's becoming very popular in really? India. And it's constantly becoming more and more popular. Yeah. Like I go to like tier 2, tier 3. So it's not illegal? It is illegal. No, even smoking is illegal. Cigarettes? No, ma marijuana. Yeah, it's illegal. Okay. It's still, I think, uh, what's it called? Category A, category okay. 1. Uh, so it's categorized in the same uh, places, cocaine, I, I thought having some quantity is illegal or something like, like in the West, what is the... So I saw a recent reel. You, you've seen that Pulp Fiction yeah, yeah, yeah. clip, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> so uh, the, between Travolta and uh, Samuel Jackman. So uh, wait a minute. So uh, your smoking is not illegal. Him catching you is illegal. <laughs> <laughs> and he says, that's it, I'm going to Amsterdam. <laughs> I'm going to Amsterdam. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, iconic movie. Yeah, Big, great. It was just a bunch of micro podcasts put together oh, yes. in that movie. Anyway. No, but you talk about cigarette. I so, think uh, cigarettes? Uh, I, 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 I'll tell you about marijuana. Yeah. It is illegal, even yes. if you're caught with a little bit. If you're caught smoking, it's still legal. Right. illegal. Uh, you can be fined. I believe you got to bail yourself out. There is there is a illegal angle to it. And in saying that, bhang is getting legalized. It's already legal in MP, Rajasthan. I believe UP as well because I've gone to Banaras and seen so a legal So, Bhang is marijuana. What's the, the cannabis is marijuana, is it? It's one species okay. and like imagine like different, um, right? like Caucasian, Asian, <laughs> uh, African, like that's the, yes. that's the raw explanation, <laughs> right, but right. it's the same high same because high. <laughs> the active molecule is the same, which yes. is THC. Yes. So when some uncle auntie get high on holy <laughs> through bhang, it's the same thing their kids are doing in colleges <laughs> yes. all over the country today. Correct. <laughs> Very secretly mm. because, uh, especially like people born before 1980, you guys were, really told that weed, marijuana, cannabis is a category A drug. Yes. So you can't have a conversation often with people from that era yeah. about this not being as harmful as coke. But in saying that... Plus it's difficult. It was difficult to procure as well. Really? Yes. In our time, I remember. I mean, unless you grew it, some of my friends were growing it okay. in college, but it was routinely 
kind of spotted and then okay. as they as the ci used to do in colombia you know you kind of burn scorch <laughs> the whole place <laughs> why are um, cigarettes addictive nicotine like what 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 is the addiction for example if you ask me about alcohol yes it kills off your inhibitions for that 4 hours 5 hours that you're drunk yeah pot maybe makes like cannabis makes you more creative it makes you think deeper but i've never understood lsd sure <laughs> that's you that's on me <laughs> uh, so you know beatles i mean the 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 phase in the 60s where everyone was on drugs so beatles obviously everyone was experimenting and this uh, iconic song lucy in the sky yeah. with diamonds lucy in yeah. the sky yeah so lsd no oh, yeah yeah lucy yeah. sky diamonds yeah. psychedelics were, have yeah, caught on as a culture as well by the yes. even in india yeah. dear parents <laughs> you're watching anand ranganath and on trs let me just slip that in kids have done a lot more shit than you can imagine i remember the first my first cigarette i remember it was done by a rascal friend of mine very dear <laughs> abhishek and he said pile yaar kuch nahi hoga maza aayega and it was during those uh, mandal anti mandal protests and colleges were closed and all that and we were having bananda somewhere in a dhaba sare le le ek kash ki panama ke kash ki kasam kisi cigarette mein kahan ye dam i if i catch that rascal i'm going to like smack his bottom like tom and jerry this thing that was 1990 did you think of him in hospital not in the hospital but i blame him for this wow really yeah everyone no, no, has I'm a just joking is this trigger yeah. friend yes. even i have my bunch of trigger <laughs> friends i have been the trigger for many people in other uh, formats yeah. because i never caught on to the cigarette high maybe because i think my mom had always drilled it See, into I, my head i mean in that that age it was fashionable everyone was smoking as you said correctly said uh, and nicotine is one of the most addictive substances on earth so it's just a combination of four or five things Mm. it's just completely uh, it was fashionable and you've seen that clint eastwood you know taking the cheroot from one ah. end of his lips to the other mm. it was also and amitabh bachchan doing this mm. deewar mein you know mm. so it was all built in everything is uh, built into the you know the okay age. like the cool factor cool made factor. you totally cool yeah wow okay i smoke bd because of that but my god bd is dangerous why it just the high it hits you like crazy really? it's uh, a it's much more unhealthy there is no filter there the tar must be like 35 mg tar <laughs> uh, but uh, you know every that impressionable age everyone's looking at your role models are uh, you know your amitabh bachchan at that age we had it and uh, every every cinema actor was you know chewing bds from one end to the other so Cut to 2023 where Ronaldo's taking cold drinks and putting it on the right. side, and Kohli's not endorsing yes. sugary things. Yes. But now this new thing has started where this Kamla Pasant, uh, I think who was it? Chris Gayle and Kapil Dev and Sunil Gavaskar. So they have come into these ads. Uh, so people criticize them. I I don't know. One is I am ambivalent towards it. I mean, do you this role model business? So does it mean that if somebody is uh, you know? Uh, come in an ad for something uh, that person is using that ad i or using that product or is endorsing it other than you know in his real life as well it's strange i'm visualizing chris gale going hey man and <laughs> kamla pasand <laughs> chris gale is an exception because if he is using that he is a universe boss so you know i mean there would be millions following him but i mean kapil dev using that i don't know or sunil gavaskar i don't know okay okay yeah. Let's talk about the... that's why akshay kumar also got a lot of flack for uh, kesri uh, what was that zuba bolo zuba kesri zuba bolo zuba and you know this kind of churchill salute but funny thing is sharukh khan and uh, ajay devgan never were never got the flack for this when akshay kumar joined them he so much so that he said all the proceeds that i get from this i will give it away to charity mm. but of course the coup d'etat was uh, james bond pierce brosnan he was roped into this kamla pasand uh, really ad. yes and it was in kanpur all the billboards and everyone thought my god james bond is having this <laughs> <laughs> and later it turned out that they kind of tricked him they said sir this is some mint some mint product and all that very i mean a year later it came out so james bond did not know <laughs> that this is gutka but was brilliant yeah. the guy who managed it salute to you gutka <laughs> companies make a lot of money oh it's incredible you build a product that can be yeah. addictive and you'll be rich yeah
but this is like truly biologically addictive yes <laughs> yeah. so these are playlists made especially for you we've tailor made learning experiences for you the rs clips